Now in this part of the question, we know that k is 12, and so by substituting k equals 12 into the first three terms, you can get that the first three terms now are 16, 12, and 9. So it makes finding the common ratio very easy because all you've got to do, let's just say what the common ratio is going to be, all you've got to do is simply take any term and divide it by its previous term. So if you did say 12, you could do 12 divided by 16, that would be the common ratio. Or you could do 9 divided by 12. I'm going to pick 9 divided by 12, but it obviously doesn't matter which one you pick. And in this example, you can divide top and bottom here by 3 and get 3 over 4. 3 quarters then is the common ratio.